And we're back in Depraved for episode number six. Um, so last time, we're well on our way to getting our first settler, but they have needs. Uh, this, to get a proper settler, we do actually need bread and booze. Uh, we've actually satisfied the other requirements. And water, firewood, clothing. Well, we haven't actually really got much firewood on the go at the moment. There is firewood being created by uh, the... Someone or other. I think it's him. I <laughs> can't quite remember. Uh, and we're, we're on our way to getting booze, I think. And we're, Saloon is... I can't remember where we put the bloody saloon now. It's, it's around here somewhere. <laughs> it's as far as I can remember. Our warehouse is actually starting to fill up quite nicely. And we haven't got a huge amount of grain. Uh, but we will do soon, because we want to turn that into bread. Our bakery's not quite done yet. That was a bit weird. Uh, but... Still, that's on its way. We need more planks of wood, which we haven't really got at the moment. So we'll, I'm going to check the areas of all our workers. Our hunter, this hunter up here, I've, um, I've moved the area to over here because there's a lot of animals up there. Actually, there might be some wolves there. I think there are. There's some wolves there, which isn't ideal. Uh, I should be fine, though. Um, any other hunters? There's another hunter here, isn't there? Um, who's got that area, which does seem a bit empty, so I'm going to have to move that a bit further out, I think. Just to there, I think. So we'll definitely have some good meat on the go. Uh, there's the lumberjackery. That area is... Mm, might have to move that a bit further to there to future-proof that. And I think we've got another lumberjackery over here, don't we? Oh, I haven't even moved this area. That's <laughs> it's a bit piss. I could actually have a hunter here as well. We've got a wolf. We've got to be careful. The lumberjack might get attacked. Uh, right, so who have we got over here? This is Ch um, Carly. What are you doing? You're a labourer. You're just carrying... By the looks of it, you're carrying some meat. Uh, so let's speed things up a little bit. So as I say, well, my, my goal in this episode is really to get, like, um, our first settlers established and maybe try the whole, like, um, setting up a place elsewhere, just to see how that works, really. And there isn't a huge amount to um, to really aim for in this game at the moment. Really, it's just a case of um, trying to get lots of settlers and then eventually getting some merchants. And then just like keeping things ticking over, really. So I think in this in this playthrough, we'll probably um, we'll come to an end um, quite soon. Maybe this episode, depending on how things go. Uh, just because um, I think we'll have seen everything um, in the alpha at the moment. Um, so, oh god, here we go. Right. So things are happening all at once. I think it's taking care of itself, though. Spe go to one speed. It's being shot over there at the moment. There we go, look. Shot. And you, you were you're a bandit who were like trying to steal, but you got arrested. But there's no sheriff at the moment, um, and you was a bandit. Who, uh, you were someone who just got completely shot to bits. So yeah, I think our gunslinger situation is um is quite good at the moment. I think our two lads. Uh, by the way, the um the one who died mysteriously the, um, in last episode, as someone pointed out, was actually um was actually the guy who died on the st on the um the on the stairs of the doctor. But I can't quite remember. It's been a few days... Again, it's been a while since I recorded the last episode. <laughs> uh, our bridge has barely been touched, but then that's unsurprising, because, again, just not enough wood flapping about the place. So how are we doing sheriff-wise? Can we actually... I think... I can't remember if we started building a sheriff or not, so I'm going to have to have a little bit of a, a checky-poos there. Uh, no, we actually have to have five settlers. That's right. Okay. I um, thought that might be the case. So I'm going to speed things up quite a bit... Uh, because it's just, you know what, you know what, uh, we, we are, we're getting a bit of money now because we're actually getting some cash in. So we're actually going to buy in some wooden planks. They don't seem to be hugely expensive. So I'm going to buy 80 quid. Let's change it up to about 20. So we're spending 160 quid on planks, which isn't much. That's not a huge problem. So the next trader will come in and dump us some logs and we can actually get moving again because we are just getting very slow. I'm wondering about whether the sawmill's gone out of hand and just not producing anything. Uh, where's the sawmill? I always forget where the sawmill is. You're not doing anything at the moment. You're really not doing anything. There's no wood coming in, by the looks of it. What are these bloody choppers doing? There's a rogue horse. There's... Oh, cash. I just found some cash lag about the place. And there's... There he is. There's Randy. Off he goes. He's got very long arms. It's realised. Coming down to his knees. Maybe he needs long arms for, to actually rip down these trees. There he goes, there's a little stag. And off he goes again. So I think it's just... Oh, hello, I'm over here. Oh, hang on. Oh, it flipped over here because that... 
there was an event happening. I didn't realize that happened. Maybe that's some um, because every time I play this game, there's a bit. There's been a new upgrade, um, a new update. It's, this is Alpha One Point One Three B now. Um, by the looks of it, this guy is being absolutely attacked the hell out of. And can I actually get the gunslinger here in time? Probably not. There's no one else around. Um, oh, these 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 lads. Um, let's try and get you stuck in. Like that. Are you even trying to attack? Fight back. I think you are. Punch. Yeah, just drop your stuff on the ground and come and get stuck in. At least you're really close to the doctor. Wolf punch. Punch. Kick. There we go. Punch to death. And everyone's back. Oh, the, the bloody mate turned up just in the nick of um, five minutes too late. Well... Dead wolf. Meanwhile, you. This is a lumberjack. He's scared. He's just staring at the chopped tree in horror. There's also a bear there. Maybe it's a, maybe it's the bear that he's actually getting pissy about. Mate, you probably should go to the doctor. There we go. He's sorting out the well. I think that's what he was doing. He was he was doing the old welly poos. I'm thinking about maybe attacking the. Oh god, this is going to happen again, isn't it? I'm thinking about maybe taking out this bear. Can I actually drag both of you lads? Yes, I can. I'm, I'm going to do a, like a double gunslinger situation. Right, come on. Come on, units. Come on, my absolute units. Topless gunslinger of all singing Sandyville. Someone's homeless. Oh, it's the, it's the lumberjack. Okay. Now I've actually got rid of my mates. Oh, actually, thankfully, they, they just happened to have seen the bandit. They just happened to be in passing. Okay, that's fine. Anyway... I'm completely confused where things things are now. Hang on, I've got three gunslingers. Oh, I've, oh I did see what I did. I picked uh, one gunslinger and one total random. He's just some bloke. I only wanted you. Also, the bear seems to have gone now. Oh, the bear's there. Come on. Let's try and get the bear. Although, I really should have got the other. Come on. I think I'm going to have to bring you in as well. Uh oh. This is probably not ideal thinking about it. Maybe we should retreat. What are you doing? Are you are you even attacking? This is probably not This probably wasn't the best thing to do, was it? No, I should have really Yeah. <laughs> I shouldn't have done this at all. Oh piss. <laughs> well, there goes one of our gunslingers. God damn it. I'm going to try and shoot it with the other guy, because it must be injured by now. Shit, that's... Okay, come on. Bear really attacks very quickly, doesn't it? Oh, it's fine. Well, I get him injured. I'm... I just want to get rid of that bear, because, um... Well, this place is... Oh, there's so many wolves around here. I really don't think this is a good place to be. Also, you're still here. I'm worried about you. I think I'm going to try and move you. I think he might be might have got a bit. No, he's still he's still terrified. He's scared of something. He's also homeless. Well, I'm gonna move him just randomly. Hopefully, like he'll get non not scared from going away somewhere. You need to get to the bloody doctors, mate. There we go. I think the trouble is with this game. Sometimes when you when you're trying to select when you pr try to click the button to actually get them to do something, if you're e moving the mouse even slightly left to right or whatever, um, it, the the click doesn't register. So it's a bit of a piss at that. God, poor dead bandit. Oh, not bandit. Gunslinger. Woody. Oh well, he was a good lad. Unfortunately, now we've actually got no real defence because our other lads in the dock tour. It's a bit of a maybe a bit of a mistake, but. We actually aren't attracting any new lads at the moment. We've got two houses ready for our new settlers, but as I say, we don't actually have any... Um, we don't have the right stuff. I think it's the saloon I should really concentrate on. Let's put that at the top notch. We've got no wood again. We're, we're trying to build too much stuff, I think. But we are making actually buckets of cash. Oh, that's why, because the, the gunslinger is now not taking up our cash. I have to buy yet more bloody wood. It's, unfortunately, the price of wood has shot up. I think probably because I am 
Yeah, the demand is high from me. But let's get even more wood. It's, at the moment, it's taking way too long to actually get anything done. Now it's gone, it's gone, gone really dark. It takes a while for the lights to come on. Nearly done with the saloon. Prioritised it. Bought in loads of wood. It kind of look, looks like it might be being unloaded. Oh, no. I think it's just... Oh, God, it's summer already. Blimey. Oh, wow. I... <laughs> yeah. What's this? Oh, this is finally... Um, suddenly... We're doing well with the sawmill. Oh, there's, there, there he is. It's literally just there. Unfortunately, the, um, the gunslinger... Oh, the gunslinger is actually there. I think he's actually shooting through the warehouse. Huh. A bandit has died. Good. Now the logs are really on the go. I think there was something gumming up our loggery. Uh, but I don't never quite wear that out, but it seems to be okay at the moment. Anyway, um, we now have our saloon. Booze. We need booze. Uh, we don't have any booze, so we can't sell it. So where's our... I'm sure we're building a distillery somewhere. Building a mill, which has now got all the logs it needs. Building the bakery, which has almost got all the planks. No, did we actually? Are we? This is the, th this is the thing. It's sometimes hard to find buildings. Are we actually? What are you doing? We've still got more homeless lads. I think we've got a new lad turned up. That's why. So we do need possibly another basic worker tent. Oh no, we don't. We, oh hello. Oh, it's the lumberjack. Oh no. I don't think this is a very good place for the lumberjack to... Oh no, I'm going to have to attack it. This is not a very good location for the lumberjack to be in because of the amount of wild prickeries. Dead. Shite. Also, gold. Gold theft. Where is he? He's over there. Come on, gunslinger. You get back 225 quid. Right, don't need to actually um, grab the money this time. I wonder if that's actually been um, like, um, updated out of the game. I don't know. So I'm not sure what I should do about this lumberjack situation. This place is crawling with pricks. I mean, there's loads of other trees down here, but... Unfortunately, that lumberjack over there is miles away from this. So Randy should be around here somewhere, doing what he does best. But at least we'll actually get some plankage. Anyway, what I was trying to find is make sure that we've got some way of actually making booze. Where is the booze area? There's under food, is it? Oh, that's fish and meat. Here we go, a distillery. Have we got a distillery on the go at the moment? Pig farm? I don't think we have, in theory. Small church, saloon, lumberjack, bakery, mill, which has now been made. Pig farm, butcher, warehouse. I don't think we... Uh, there's one thing we obviously... Oh, we've got Taylor as well, haven't we? Taylor Swift and the weaving mill. No, it looks like we are actually going to have to build a distillery. I completely thought we'd, we'd doing that. It was quite a big... It's an absolute unit of a, of a place. Maybe that was... A, well, I didn't build it previously because there's no room. Bring it down in the middle there. <laughs> nope. See how much we are running out of space now. I wonder if we should like them bung it here then. What do we actually need for the distillery? Uh, it turns grain and water into it. Feels like I was going to build it somewhere around here, but I never did. I could probably slide it in here. Um, what's the rotating button? I can't remember actually. <laughs> never mind. Oh, I could put it there, weirdly. Oh, uh, in theory, you might also be able to put it there. But no. Oh, hang on. Maybe, 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 maybe. There. But this way, this way it would be... Cl would it be closer to the grain of... I reckon, I reckon here. After all that. Put it... This might... Although it's in water as well. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. Right, here. And this is my final decision. We can just find out where the sweet spot is again. Uh, obviously, prioritise that. <laughs> and then we've got no bloody planks again. Uh, it looks like the bakery is next on the list, so that'll be built anytime soon. 
Bakery, there we go. It looks like already the mill is in operation, making flour. And the bakery will then take that flour and presumably something else and turn it into bread. Uh, that's another thing that on our settlers list, as soon as we get start getting bread, we might get settlers. A dead horse? Oh, it's that dead horse. The one that was just li lying about the place for, for no reason. Let's just double check our stables. That's full. That stable is full. Where's the other stable? That stable is nearly full. Only two more horses. So we will reluctantly have to build another stable. Another horse area. But this is low priority business, I think. But I'll, I'll bung it up here because it's. Who cares? Oh, all these bloody graves up there now. The Undertaker's on the go again. There he is. There's our lad. Oh no, the, the new lumberjack is now being attacked. Ham! Ham the lumberjack. I have to arm these guys. He doesn't even have a house. I was going to actually build another house, wasn't I? I'm not even going to bother with that. There's nothing really much I can do. He'll die. He'll get over it. So, we need a... What is it called again? A... Shack, isn't it? I'm running out of space totally now. Uh, we are... Can put it, yeah, put it there. Right on the edge of things now. I was hoping that wolf might be injured from before, but obviously not. This is Lumberjack Alley now. Dead Lumberjack Alley. Uh, yeah, they'll keep on coming. Slowly but surely. Okay, so I think now is a good time to try, and out, try out this um, settlers thing. Hang on a second, buy a settler wagon. That did... They used to cost 2,500 quid, I'm sure of it. I'm sure it only cost 500 quid previously. Huh. But suddenly we're losing a shitload of cash. Should probably do something about that. Oh look, there's Lumberjack is, is now being taken away. The first the first dead Lumberjack, the second Lumberjack is um, still dead. Very much lying around the place. I'm um, selling loads of water, by the way. Uh, because we had, we've had we got so much of it. Actually, we've got loads of meat as well. Well, we did, until that started to disappear. Let's see if um, meat is worth selling at the moment. Eight quid per meat. Hmm. I'll sell a bit of it. I'll give us 80 quid. That's not much. Right, meanwhile, our gunslinger is... Oh, didn't quite get him in time. I should have think his, mm, his area is purely the warehouses at the moment. We need a second gunslinger for that, but first of all, I need to arrest our cash situation, which is... As I say, he's getting out of hand. I think we just need to sort of like start building more stuff. Because we are... We are... Well, we've got all these new buildings on the go. Which might be a bit of a problem. Everything's so full. We need more labourers doing stuff. Everything's... Why is everything getting full of a sudden? Crap. It's all getting a bit mad at the moment. I can't even see where that thief went. Oh no, that's the... Yeah, that's the old thief, isn't it? There's the train. Choo choo. They have no effect on anything, I don't think. But always nice to see. So we've got 47 pioneers, and we still haven't got any settlers. Now the bread thing, the bread thing should happen soon, but the booze thing is a whole different thing. Now the distillery is coming along. We've only got two planks. They'll just have to wait for the lumberjacks to do their thing, or one of the lumberjacks. I'm tempted. Oh, God. Is this happening again? Actually, where is this lad? It is, it's, it's the new lumberjack. He's also being killed by the same bloody wolf. Well, we may have to do something about this. We may need a posse. Oh, no, the wolf is... That wolf has finally died. Let's get him to the doctors. Is he actually going in there? Yes, there he is. Going into there. You have to always see it from the front. It looks like we've got a pot. There's a posse! Oh no, it's just the labourers. I think the labourers are taking the, the water to the cellarium. The town hall. To f oh, yep, 13 left to sell. 10 meats left to sell as well, but nobody's buying at the moment. Mm, this quidded situation is not good. Money is scarce. I just, want to, I just want to get this built. Night time again. Uh, one thing I'm keen to do is... Um, I'm, I'm trying. I'm going to turn off a couple of things 
to save us some cash. That's I've got two stonemasons, and probably don't need to. Oh god, I'm not quite sure where that was. Uh, this is best not to do it at night time, admittedly. Stonemason. Where is that area? That's almost exhausted. There's only nine left there. So, therefore, I'm going to stop production. In fact, I'm just going to destroy it. Hold to destroy. There. Oh, I really had just disappeared into the night, leaving some stone behind. Right, so that's actually improved our profitability a tiny, tiny bit. Now we're down to minus 41. Unfortunately, there's so many new buildings that it's suddenly costing us a lot of cash. We do need more houses and things. Distillery almost built now. Ironically, just as I destroyed that stonemason, or just shortly after, um, I have discovered that the stonemason needs a new area anyway. I have a horrible feeling I am accidentally um, changed his area by mistake anyway, so... We do need to find some more stone to mine. Somewhere. Well, there's a bandit camp. Still think I could actually send some lads in, a little posse, to destroy all that, but... We haven't really, we've got hardly any stone at all. I'm going to have to go for this. I'm sure this was what we were doing previously. I, must, I think I might have just uh, accidentally moved it, but anyway. So, stonemasons is now hopefully sorted out. This is now complete. We need even more grain and water. I'm wondering whether I should set up a second grain farm at this rate. But we have now got three bread, though. We actually have started making it. So the mill and the bakery all... Oh, god damn it. And... Well, who's been attacked? Oh, everything's happening. Oh, no, everything's happening at once. Someone's dead. Someone's been shot by the gunslinger. That was the bandit. There was something about being attacked, but... What's that over here? Oh, it's just basically saying dead. Was that another dead lumberjack? There's, there's yet another lumberjack coming come into the fray. I wonder how long he'll last. There's a... I can't really see any more wolves around, so we may be actually okay. We may have actually, um, finally taken care of that. Uh, unfortunately, the th there was a thief that, um, yeah. Unfortunately, I can't really keep an eye on both the town hall and the warehouses. 71 quid all of a sudden. Oh no, don't tell me that. Um, I think there's... The distillery costs 30 quid an, um, an hour. God. We have actually so got some money all of a sudden, though. Where that came from? <laughs> Was it because I sold some meat? I can't have been. Well, even though we are losing money, I'm keen to so I can get this settler thing on the go. There we go. Let's set up somewhere else. And because I want to see how trade, trade routes work. Let's have a look at the map. So that's our current city. We definitely may need to make sure that we are quite close to some... You literally can't move the... Hmm. Uh, we definitely need to see if we can actually get some closer to some trees and some rocks, I think. But also, I think, the other thing... I reckon, I reckon, that the main thing about this is doing... Is actually setting up camp near, like, um... Uh, where you'd actually go mining. We can't actually do that at the moment, I don't think. We have to actually start... We. I don't think the, the mining age happens until you've actually got settlers, settlers on the go. But it might be not, not be a bad idea to like set up here-ish. Then we'll have access to trees, rocks, and mining. That's actually quite a long way away, but... Let's... Let's do it. And set up... Here-ish, I guess? Uh, and there, there go our settler lads. I don't think that costs us anything other than that initial startup cost. So that's going off over there. We've got almost no money now as a result of doing that. I think I'll do some emergency. Well, maybe this lumberjack is now we're not we're not doing so much building work. I'm thinking about maybe temporarily turning that off. That saves us. Oh, lumberjacks cost two quid. No, nah, that can continue. There are certain things that cost a lot. Uh, it seems like distillery is going to be the thing. We are actually producing at the moment, by the looks of it, so we will have some booze, and therefore, very soon, we will start attracting... Hello, why are you back? The settler wagon is back. Did I just accidentally, um... I think we might need to, um... Stop unit. Hang on, that's alright. We might need, to, might need to bring him back again. I think I must have changed his movement or something. Come on, get there. 
turn around and go back. I was going over the bridge this time. Oh, I think I completely mucked that up. I think I might have been trying to send him the... Oh, I don't know. Anyway, let's try and actually get this so it's actually facing north. Yeah, I got immediately taken to here. It looks like there's two lads at once. I was really shooting back this time. A resident from Singing Sandyville can develop to the next level. That's new. Well, he's off. probably having to go to the doctors now. So that means there was some booze. Very briefly, there was some new booze. So we've actually created something, clearly. We've also got a thousand quid, somehow. I'm not going to complain. Where did that money come from? Money. Well, maybe... Um, have we actually got a new resident? We haven't yet. I'm not quite sure how that all works. The um, the settlers thing. But we haven't actually got any yet. I mean, presumably they So maybe like, the pioneer actually upgrades then. We've got four homeless... Bloody hell. We do actually need... We're still actually building this shack over here, aren't we? So that'll happen. So we will actually have to build us another one. Another shack. Can you fit it in there? We can, yes. But I'm not super bothered about all that. Meanwhile, our settle wagon has arrived. Let's settle. New town hall. Achievement unlocked. Governor, apparently. Hey, look, we've got loads of supplies. We've got especially an entire new city. Full of them. Topless lads. There's Randy too. Electric Boogaloo. Also you, which is a bit trimmer. Griffey, the builder. The hunky builder. Uh, so how do these lads um, actually... Oh, we've got Beaver Springs. Not exactly the most spriggiest place in the world. Let's call it the... Um, let's call this Deadbolt. Which is what, oh, Dadbolt? Yeah, let's call it Dadbolt. <laughs> By mistake. I was going to call it Boots Dead Boot, wasn't I? Oh well, it's called Dadbolt. Uh, and then you have to start all over again by the looks of it. Um, but what I'm interested to see is um, how trade routes, transport routes, um, actually happen. Um, add the route by clicking the symbol, or the plus symbol. Add a wagon by clicking on the wagon symbol on the map. Add a trading post by clicking on the box symbol on the map. Uh. <laughs> well, I'm clicking around the place, but I can't obviously see... What needs to be done there? Well, fine. Why are they saying up? Promote resident. Oh, oh, we have to do it manually. I don't want to promote any of those lads. Those lads are stupid. So is... Hang on a second, that's no good. I don't want those lads up there to be promoted. It's not, it's, I want these lads to be... Um, I want to turn these into settlers. Huh. I can't even upgrade Ivy the farmer. Who's wearing a very nice billowy dress. So only these lads can be promoted. What was that? I can't, that must be a mistake. Labourer, labourer, labourer. Where are the other lads? There. Griffy the topless builder. I can't promote him, apparently. <laughs> He's unpromotable. Let's promote Randy too. You're now a settler. Well, that's just ridiculous, isn't it? Yeah. Unfortunately, he's he, need, he actually needs booze. And stuff like that. This is a... Yeah, I'm not quite sure how this all works, to be honest. I feel like this it should be any of these lads who get promoted. Let me just double-check this. This seems peculiar. Oh, you can... Yeah, it's only... Oh, oh yeah, you can promote other lads down here. It's just I think a lot of these, a lot of the people here have got already got um, uh, I think you can only promote labourers by the looks of it. Alba Gillick, you can be promoted. You can be now a settler. Right, so now we actually do have one settler. Um, the other place, unfortunately, yeah, we've, we've given a set, we've given the other place, Dadbolt, a settler, which was really probably a stupid idea, <laughs> a very stupid idea. But just for a second, I thought that was the only thing we could do. Uh, so it's a, it's a manual thing. That's most, most peculiar. Anyway, let's get... We could get shacks on the go. Oh, a gunslinger. We've got a, a gunslinger's coming to Dad Bolt. We can't afford him at the moment. We've got no cash. Right. What's the difference in terms of speed? 
I think we should just go for shacks immediately. Because they are better value, I think. Two, three, four, five. Uh-oh. Minor problem. <laughs> uh, I may have just um, absolutely screwed us. Those cost a lot of money to build, and now we're, we're in negative land. We're over the edge. Oh dear. And also there were wolves. Oh, there were bulls. There were bulls. That's okay. Uh, <laughs> I may have just totally buggered up as... I'll try and sell some stuff, maybe. Although we're not really... Hmm. Money-wise. I'm not quite sure how we're going to make instant... I can fire our gunslinger, but then everything will get stolen. And that'll only save us 25 quid. Maybe did I expand too far too quickly? Can I start selling my booze, maybe? I don't know how much time we've got, how much grace time we've got before we lose. Um, we haven't got that much booze. Could try and sell some of it. At five. That only gets 35 quid. But for whatever reason, we are now making slightly more. And we could... What could it do? That it doesn't just cripple our town. We could turn off the distillery, but then we'd lose our settler edge. And then, I'm not quite sure what would happen there, either. Well, just pause it for now. One pause. Is that... Still costs 15 quid an hour, even when it's paused. Oh, bloody hell. Well, if I, if I promote people, they should actually pay higher rent. So I can just find someone to promote. You, the wood carrier. Well, that didn't seem to do much to the cost. In fact, very briefly, um, it cost us more. But then it went away again. Oh, here we go, look. we finally got one... Yeah, two settlers now living in... Oh. Do this. Well, it hasn't actually... Um... No, I don't know. Now we've got another gunslinger, but we can't afford him. We're down to minus 34, so... I don't know. What you? Let's upgrade you. And you. Oh, it's Randy! Let's promote Randy. Yes, he is now a um, trailer park supervisor. New building available. Oh, we've got five set. Well, we haven't quite got five settlers. There are not enough workers in Dadbolt. Oh, God. So we have to basically run two towns. Someone's just oh, it's the distillery that's asleep. Everything's got weird and frantic now. But, yeah, that has actually unlocked a watchtower, an iron mine, coal mine, and an iron smelter. So we could actually go and iron... <laughs> iron that mine? Mine the iron up in Dadbolt, although we can't do it anytime soon because we have to attend to all these lads' needs. Not quite sure what I'm going to do about this. Well, probably nothing. How is, why is the gunslinger here? Oh, it's just, it's just hanging out. He's not actually doing anything. So he's not actually going to do anything, I don't think. Oh god, we're just losing cash. Uh, well, I just want to see, just have a quick check to see from Route 1. Piss. If we call it piss, maybe that'll help. But at the moment, I just don't. Oh dear, there's some. I did a new route. I know I don't have to. Turn... Don't know how to turn it off. Um, add a wagon by clicking the wagon symbol on the map. Well, there isn't one, so I'm not quite sure if this is some. Um, what's going on here at all? Um, does this even work? No, I don't know. I honestly don't know about that at the moment. Maybe that is something for the next update, maybe. But. I'm probably wrong. Probably just incompetent. Uh, for, for whatever reason, now we are making cash again. Maybe there's a bit of a delay on that, like a month delay or something. But, I don't know. But, anyway, I think, I think we are naturally coming to the end of this anyway now, I think. Um, we, we could keep going with all the other stuff, like um, all the new buildings, whatever. But, uh, I think um, bad planning has got us to a bit of an awkward situation with the whole cash thing. So, I don't know where we're actually going to go from here. Um, so we'll bring this to a close. We may revisit this game um, um, quite soon. Um, I've got a lot going on, other stuff going on at the moment, so probably not at the moment, but um, we'll see. Just taking one final look around the place. Um, good old Malaria Alley. We've got other people we could upgrade as well. There's upgrading going on all over the place at the moment. I think if I keep on upgrading stuff, eventually we will actually maybe just keep on making more and more rent. Uh, and we will actually solve our money problems. We're already um, getting back on track to some extent. But then we've got this whole problem up here of a new town that we have to do something with. 
Everyone just stopped. Oh, we haven't got any bloody wood, have we? Oh, sod, Dad Bolt. <laughs> it was a bad idea from the start. Uh, anyway, so, yep, yeah, th th thanks for watching this series. Um, um, and all that. Um, do, if you want to follow the further adventures of Randy, um, what was it? Trader there. Uh, the further adventures of Randy, do check out my uh, series on the new series of Machia Villain, because Randy is in that as the depraved psychopathic lumberjack, which is all a lot of fun. Ah, right, so. I've got to need a new. I do actually need a new sh um, stables and everything. Ah, whatever. There's always something new to do. So, yep, um, I'll see you next time. Bye for now.